crimes and snitching to get out of it. Because yeah. I'm big on that because when I did my thing back in the day, they tell you either you're going to get killed or you're going to go to jail. But you can't tell. What do you mean, tell him to do the crime? No, 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 meaning, let me say it slowly. He's yeah. saying, like, a, um, like, what would you tell about the kids? Like, you already answered it. You said, don't do the crime. Like, if you do the crime, show me to the Shut, Shut the, the fuck, fuck, fuck up. up. Yeah. That's it. Question answered. That's what he said. Emphatically, no cat, no dog. No, they took your mother. No, your elephant. Shut like I said, my mother up. went on the run for seven years. I haven't saw, I haven't seen my mother from 1993 until 2012. Mm. From 1993 to 2012. That was like 18 and, years. And, and you know what she did? She shut the fuck up. Hey, she you know what I mean? Years, so so that's why I'm telling them out. that y'all yeah, yeah, yeah. ain't trying to be taken away from your mother as much as y'all ain't listening to them and all that. Y'all don't want to be here from your mother for 18 years, my nigga. Damn near two decades. That shit hurts, man. My mother Shut came to see me using a walker when we was in the club dancing. We was doing a whop and all that. Shout out to your the mother, bump. man. Stand you know up, what I mean? Stand up woman, man. Stand up, so man. Stand up. My mother would do the same thing. So that's why I tell the youth it's not worth it. You know what I mean? Don't my even mother get involved. loved me. She loved me, mom. I love you. My she mother loved, loved me. But my moms would have been like, boy, you got your ass in that. You know what I'm saying? That's on you. I got your sister. I got your this. We got other people to take care of. You want to do that? Nah, the thing then is, you gotta, you listen, gotta man. eat that. Listen, the thing she is, loved me. my, my, my but, father was you know, a hustler. You understand what I'm saying? He still yeah, parties yeah, in the yeah, basement yeah. in Jersey and all that and do his thing. So gangsters came in there. Pimps came in there. Everything came in there. I watched them growing up from I came to America when I was seven years old. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I heard these rules, these codes and everything. And my mother and father, the people that was coming in the party, in the bar, the same way people came in Club 2000, there was killers, there was murderers, there was drug dealers, there was credit card scammers, there was boosters, everything came in. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So my mother knew each profession <laughs> and knew that each one had a code. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So when I chose my profession to become a drug dealer, you understand what I'm saying? My mother knew there was a code to that. So she's like, if you go out there and play those, play with them goddamn people on the street, you know something happened, you carry on, and you don't tell on nobody the same way I beat your ass when you came in here and told me that your brother fell down and messed up his new shoes or whatever. <laughs> I got a beating and caught that telling. Or such and such, you know, hit hit my brother. You know what I mean? They said that my brother, you know, you know, got hit in the school or whatever happened in the school or whatever. Or, you know, almost got in a fight. My mom beat my ass for telling. What happened out there in the streets with you and your brother stay out there and you're on the streets and you defend your brother. So don't come back and tell me that you felt nobody disrespect your brother and you didn't take his head off. Mm. Like, you know, that's the way I was raised. So your mother's bottom line, your mother's a stand-up woman. She exactly, because she, she came from that era. She knew what it was. I mean, she wasn't into none of that. Let's okay. get that straight. But she knew when I chose that life that these are the rules and codes that go with that life and don't dishonor nothing you get involved with. Mm -hmm. yep. The only thing you, t I seen, you see your mother got you one time when she chose a man over you. Yeah. He was a little jealous. I was like that, so I didn't want to worry about my mommy. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. Of course. <coughs> I'm, a, I'm a mama. That's boy. my baby. Yeah, yeah. And she said, not a line. She said, you were right. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we yeah. still talk about that. I'll tell that story on my own joint later, but that got a, a deep and, joint went with it, how that went. Because, well, you, know, it, 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 you know, she sided with him over me. And you, you know? said, right now, God forbid if something happens to your mom, you said you're going to hold him down, a new man. Yeah, almost definitely. Yeah, you said you got him. Yes, <laughs> because a new man been with her the whole time I was locked up. Yeah. Where now she's bedridden and he takes care of her. God bless her. So if, something, if she goes first, I got to take care of him. Like, if, you know, that's my father now. Well, yeah. God bless She all right. She hanging in there. Yeah. Now, now, what's the most shocking person ever told you couldn't believe a nigga? 